everyone, it's Nay and welcome to my update for my Beauty A to Z project pair. Uh, this project was started by Jessica and Amanda, um, who are part of Fantastic Ladies. Um, and it's pretty much what it sounds like. You choose a beauty pro pro product uh, for each letter of the alphabet and work on that to either finish it or achieve a goal. Um, yeah, so so f you sh it's probably been, I don't know, about three weeks since my last update. I don't think it's been a full four. Um, but I thought I'd get on here while I've got the opportunity because I actually have some major usage. All right. So start from the top, uh, A, I've got this Avon Glimmer Stick it's in Mocha Flash. This thing won't die, um, still about half a centimetre left. Started off the year at about one centimetre, so I've used about half of what it was. Um, it's really quite dry, hence why I'm desperately trying to use it up. Um, doesn't look like it's going to happen, looks like it's coming into the new year with me, which is a bit annoying. Um, because I use this probably three days a week, sometimes more. So it's a bit frustrating <laughs> how slow this one's going. Uh, for B, I've got the blushette in Barbara Ann. This came from MAC, it's a cream blush. Um, that's all I've got left of this guy. Um, this guy started off at 20.04 grams and my goal was to hit 19 grams. Um, I actually haven't been able to find those scales for a while. Um, but really the goal was to try and use up half of the product that was left. Um, so that was about a gram at the time. It's currently down to 0.8 centimetres. Um and showing 18 grams on my scales so I think I'm actually going to call this one um, gold met um, because if you look at the plastic bit here um, that takes up a fair bit of that so I'm pretty confident in saying that I used up um, half of the product that was left because it started at 1.2 centimeters it's now down to 0.8 Bearing in mind that nearly half of that is plastic, um, I am going to call that one Gold Met. Uh, I'm thinking at the end of the year, some of these where I had goals, rather than like actually expecting to use them up, I thought um, at the end of the year I might do a little bit of a recap just on a couple of these because um, I have been still working on some of the ones where I have actually met my goal but not finished. <clears throat> Alright, C was done, D was done, E was done, F is this Fantasia lipstick. Um, my goal is to get it down to the crossbar on that A, the green A, when I hold it up like that. It's close, it's not quite there. It's certainly within that green A. Um, since masks have been a thing for me all day at work, um, I've been tending towards bolder lipsticks to try and get some use out of things that I wouldn't always necessarily feel comfortable wearing. Um, so this one has gone a bit to the wayside. Um, but with a couple of months left to go, bearing in mind I am going to be on holidays for two weeks um, very shortly, it'll be interesting to see whether I hit that goal, but I am very, very close. So reasonably satisfied, but we'll keep going. Uh, for G, was another Avon Glimmer Sticks, this time in Burgundy Shop. Similarly to the Mocha Flash one, um, this one's still at about 0.5 centimetres. Uh, started off at about 0.9. This one I use slightly less than the brown one, but I do use one or the other of them. They're both quite dry. They just won't die. Looks like that one's probably going to be around next year as well. Alright. 
for H I had the Happy Booster blush and my goal was to finish that. And I have, um, which is pretty amazing. I reckon it's the first blush I've ever finished. It was a pretty big blush. Um, it's certainly bigger than a MAC pan. And I know that because I got all excited about finally maybe being able to get rid of this packaging. And then I thought, oh, I wonder how much bigger it is compared to this one. And what do you know? That, the pan's actually metallic. Um, and as it turns out, this packaging is as efficient as anything I've got to put this in to use it up. Um, so this is what I'm using at the moment. So as much as I thought I was going to be getting that out of my house, it's coming through slightly reborn. Um, I think and my plan is to use this one until the end of the year. Um, and then I will look at rolling in something um, that's a combination product. So like a bronze blush and highlighter all together product. Um, but yeah, so happy to get that out. It's actually empty. It's actually done. Which is just so awesome. I think it's, I'm pretty sure it's the first blush I've ever actually finished. So I'm super happy with that. Mind you, it still, this still gets, a, it's still, it's still good, gets better. Well, I don't know about better, but it's good. Uh, for eye, I've got the In the Gallery quad from MAC. My goal is to hit side pan on this guy here. Um, I tried to measure it. It's still measuring about the same. I ended up gouging out a tiny bit of this colour when I was trying to use the ruler. Um, yeah, it's, it's certainly getting there. Um, I use this probably twice a week or thereabouts. Um, I still think I can get close to that goal. I don't know if I'll quite get there. Um, but we will keep going and see how we do. For J... I hit the goal for K, I ended up changing because I lost my original K, so now I've got this Michael Kors perfume in Wonderlust. I don't love it, it's a bit heavy for me, um, a bit potent, um, but um, yeah, not my kind of scent. It's starting to get dark in here, isn't it? So I just played around with the light. I don't know if it's made any difference. Um, yeah, this guy I've probably used five times, maybe six. I've probably got four, maybe five uses left in it. It seems to be worse if I go from this way. Um, yeah, so we'll keep going and should get it used by the end of the year, even if I have to concentrate it on it for the last week. Can't see it being an issue. Over the page. Right. Vanilla Quartz for Q. Skin Perfector from Becca. And when I said it was getting as good, goal was to finish this. This one is also done. Um, I think the blush lasted about two weeks from the last... One or two weeks from my update. This one lasted probably about a week longer. But it's gone. Um, yeah, I watched too much Tash, um, too much Tash. Uh, pan one of these. It only took her a matter of months. This one I think took me about eighteen. Um, so I'm slow and I don't use great, great heaps of it. But it is done. Um, unfortunately, this one isn't actually metallic. <laughs> After I realised the other one was metallic, I thought, oh, if this is metallic, I'll put an eyeshadow in there. I've got a big stiller one, um, like really shiny in a highlighty type colour one. I thought, oh, there's just in a pad. I thought, oh, if that fits in there, I'll put it in there. But um, it doesn't seem to want to stick, which is a bit unfortunate because I quite actually like this packaging. Um, I'll keep it. I'll probably end up repressing something in there at some stage. Um, okay. Ah, oh, we've got the Baron's Rose Lipstick from MAC. 
my goal is to reach 19 grams on this and I start at 19.74 um, hard to tell with this one because I can't get the scales can't find the scales again um, in April I measured it at 1.9 centimeters it's now measuring at 1.8 um, so yeah don't know quite what I'm going to do with this one now I was really expecting to be able to find um, my scales by now um, similarly to the Fantasia lipstick these are sort of my everyday ones and they've kind of taken a back seat at the moment anyway I think, I think last time I was talking about setting a goal against here but I can't remember what that was now either hmm. maybe it was the orange bar anyway probably not going to happen now anyway <clears throat> I'm sorry I'm really, it's really struggling here um, alright, it's Smooth Minerals Eye Pencil in Pebble. My goal was to get it onto there, which I've done. I don't know why I'm showing this again. I probably just should have left it till the end of the year and we'll see if we can get it done. Um, yeah, so I'd really like to finish this one. Goal was to get the lid over there, which I've done. I use Ultra Balm from Lush, currently weighing at 8 grams, last time it was 10, but that means a whole lot. Um, I think I can get this done by the end of the year, so especially if I'm going to be home a bit more, because um, it's one that tends to live at home and doesn't tend to travel with me. Um, yeah, I had a goal last year of hitting pan, which is why it's got a pick dip in the middle. Um, but you can certainly see that I've been working that in. Um, I reckon the last time I did an update, I was just showing pan around the outside, and now I've got a good finger's width of pan around that little goal in the middle. Um, so there's probably only another month or two if I'm consistent with that usage. Uh, for V, I've got this seven day scrub from Clinique. I thought I did use this once, but it is still measuring at 67 grams, which is what it appears to have been last time. Feels like it's sitting down around about here. Um, my goal was to get it down to 50 grams. Again, possibly not going to happen unless all of a sudden I decide to use it some more. Um, I tend to only use that one if I'm wearing a like makeup removing cleanser. Um, rather than um, in the shower um, so yeah it doesn't get a whole lot of use um, my preferred is a lush one okay next is for X which is this Magic's face perfector uh, sorry face primer um, an old shave on one though it's marked so it's not that old um, goal is to finish it, it's currently at about 18 grams um, yeah it doesn't seem to take a lot of uses to get the weight down looks like it's sitting down about the top of that M there so yeah it'll be interesting to see if I start wearing my more matte um, foundation as we're coming into summer and start using that some more um, I might get that one close. And last of all, actually, I've missed tea. I've missed tea. Let's rewind a bit. Tea. True Colour Skin Goodness CC Cream. I didn't quite have this one done at my last update. Um, but it's done now. So, yeah, in the last three weeks I've used up three products so I'm pretty chuffed with that um, nice to get those out especially an old um, scissor CC cream but an old foundation product it's nice to get that one out because that one has been hanging around for a little while and then last of all Ibiza party shampoo for Z um, this one's I know I used a little bit of it 
on the weekend, um, but it's still showing as being 108 grams, even though that's what it's been for the last couple of months, even though I've used it a few times. Um, I think realistically my goal is going to be to get the level, so it's just peaking out there, um, but I still have a little bit left of the other one that I'm mainly focusing on at the moment, which I'm hoping to use before I move on to this one. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Um, sorry about the voice, it just seems to have decided to disappear on me. Anyway, um, I'll see you in my next update and um, we'll see how we go. Hopefully I should be able to have that one used up. Maybe that one used up. Um, and that's probably going to be about it, I reckon. Um, so yeah, so far this year I have used probably at least half of these. Um, so we're going one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So I've used, I've, I've heaped, I've got all on fifteen of these so far this year. Um, so that's not too bad. It'd be nice to get a couple more out, um, but we'll see how we go. Okay then guys, see ya.